Hey guys, so welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna show and unbox the Samsung Galaxy. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna show and unbox the iPhone 6s that I bought on shop. Just a disclaimer, I am no way bragging or any bad thoughts in my mind. I'm just here to show and hopefully help you to decide whether to get the phone or not. And also, if you haven't already, please do like this video, subscribe to my channel, and smash the bell button beside the subscribe button so you will so you will notify whenever I post a new video. Without further ado, let's get started. Bali, in order ko tong phone na to noong November 11, 2020, noong 11, 11 sale ng Shopee. I've been wanting to have this phone. I really wanted to experience the iOS 14. So, noong November 11, uh, Bali, nag-browse nag ako dun sa Shopee. Di na, nakita ko yung isang store na one of the cheapest doon sa store tapos nung nakita ko yun chinect ko yung mga reviews kung maganda yung mga reviews then okay naman kaya and also uh, bali yung mga reviews yung mga nag review doon sa sa product na yun bali chinect ko sila of course para at least ma ma sure na maganda yung yung product yung so far naman yung mga respond nila okay naman daw yun yung phone working naman tapos upgradable naman sa latest software kaya din ako nag uh, alanganin na eh tas uh, chinect out ko na siya bali before ako mag check out bali chinect ko rin yung seller para at least ma sure na may stock sila tapos of course para mas ma maas na rin ng magandang quality na ibibigay sa atin so, Bali, I got the phone last November 23, so nung Monday lang. Uh, I, mean, I immediately unboxed the, the package when it arrived. Para at least makita natin kung may phone or legit pa. Dahil ito is one of the ito yung biggest purchase ko. So, yan. Bali, the phone is retail at 7250 Pero dahil may promo kasi yung seller, if you uh, buy 6,000 and above na items, you will get 200 pesos na discount. Then, noong November 11, then nag-promo yung MasterCard. If you pay yung item na binili mo through MasterCard, debit, credit, or prepaid MasterCard, you will get 200 pesos na savings. Kaya, Nakuha ko siya for only 6,850 pesos. Bali, I will be inserting the unboxing na lang right now. Bali, ito yung box ng uh, phone. Bali, ito is parang copy na box na lang siya. Mayroong ito nga yung picture ng iPhone 6S. Tapos may logo ng Apple. Doon. So, pagbukas mo, makikita mo na yung uh, 
phone is more which is 99 then kita mo yung paper works tapos meron siyang sim card detector ito sa loob meron yung airphone yung power adapter tapos yung lightning cable yan lang yung nasa loob niya and also the seller was kind enough to give me a free tempered glass tapos yung clear case so let's talk about the software yung battery tapos yung camera doon sa software software out of the box bali yung version ng ios is ios 14 bali chinek ko siya kung merong newer version meron naman the ios 14.2 bali in-update ko na siya nung kinuha ko so it took an hours bago ma-update tapos okay naman ma-smooth ma ma yung experience ko sa paggamit ng phone tapos may lag pero minimal lang yung experience ko and also there's a rumor na ito, ito na daw yung last na update ng iOS sa iPhone 6s which is well yung iPhone 6s is almost 5 na no the iPhone 6s is more than 5 years na kaya hindi naman na nakapagtataka na i-end nila yung support ng iOS po sa phone na to pero sa so far naman experience ko okay okay yung experience ko next is the battery when I got the phone, bali 80% yung, yung percentage ng battery. Pero because kasi baka kasi yung pag-update ng iOS version niya, uh, I only use 40 minutes lang bago nag-down sa 29%. Kaya charge ko, it took like 1 hour and 37 minutes para ma-full charge from 29% to 100%. Tapos yung battery health niya is 100% kaya understandable na pinalitan na nila, pinalitan na nila yung battery. But which is okay lang naman sa akin para at least magamit ko pa yung battery ng hopefully years pa. So, yun. Next is the camera. Bali, the iPhone 6S has a 5 megapixel front facing camera. It has like 12 megapixel yung rear camera niya with uh, it can take like HD video at 30 and 60 MPS it can take like 4K at 30 MPS then which is okay lang naman okay 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 dahil compared dun sa iPhone 5S ko hindi ata nakapag take ng 4K I will just insert yung mga video and uh, picture quality dito para at least malaman nyo yung quality yung quality ng phone so bali I'm just I'm currently using the iPhone 6s rear facing camera bali I'm currently using the iPhone 6s front facing camera So overall, is it like uh, worth buying the iPhone 6S this 2020? To be honest for me, uh, worth buying siya. Dahil yung phone, bali ito yung iPhone 6S. For its price na 6850 wala siyang dense kung ano mang uh, scratches which is 
I'm very lucky dahil kinausap ko kasi yung seller, nag-message ako sa kanya. Tapos dapat din pag mag magpo-purchase ka sa mga Chinese na iPhone seller, dapat dapat talk to them na isili. Tapos kung may issue, uh, mas baka na lang na i- uh, message them privately para at least ma ma-solutionan. Tapos kasi yung mga iPhone Chinese iPhone seller kasi is one of their motivation is yung 5 star na bibigay natin na rate sa kanya lang siya. Kaya mas paganda na lang na makipag-usap ng maayos. Pag secondary phone, okay okay to. Dahil smooth yung experience, walang lags masyado. Pero yung lang battery niya kasi, sa experience ko, more than 3 days ko nang ginagamit to. Halos half a day ko lang, tapos mag-charge na naman ako. Pero sa primary phone mo, hindi ko malarecommend to dahil yung aking battery na yung manobat. Tapos, pag sa gaming naman, okay naman siguro pag hindi ka heavy user sa gaming, kung sa mga uh, temporary or sa preserve ka lang, okay-okay naman siya. Kaya, yun. So, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed and learned from this video. And hopefully, I help you decide whether to get the phone or not. So, yeah. Hopefully, you are all safe, healthy, and always smile. Be happy. I will see you in my next video.